We're gonna wipe yeah, the windows down in a moment here. Uh, there's quite a few boats out here. Uh, boats at Maharo. Hmm. Wonder what that means. Okay, so I just stocked it and I got the deep. So I'm gonna check that sucker right now. This is the same scenario I had before. One beep, one light. One beep, one light. Light's not going out. Could have picked something up. Water side feels cool to the touch. Hot water side feels pretty hot. Let's see what the temp says. Page engine shows 149 on coolant temperature. Again, cool it up. Same temp. Can't hold it. Can't hold it. So just have the red triangle. There's no additional beeps. I'm waiting for an additional beep. So we got one beep, red triangle light. Alright. Well, it's not, uh, it's not real nice. It's settled down a little bit. But, uh, no, okay, so we retain the red light here. I restarted the red light. Is still on. I got Janet and Kristen on the boat today. We're going to do a little rock fishing. The one thing I didn't do was cycle power. So, I'm going to go ahead and cycle power here for the whole uh, shooting match. Engine off. Chart plotter needs to go off. Sonar's going off. Radio's off. pumps, two beaks. We have both amber engine and red triangle. Trim's good. Here we go. 16.9 hours in the Bria. I think it's 18 total. Okay, we restarted after cycling power and we retained the red triangle warning light. They don't feel any hotter than, you know, what I would think 150 feels like. I can touch them without burning myself. Alright, the red light is out. I don't know why. Red light went out. Just, oh, I had my back turned. idle I went to idle okay and I got I got the alarm one beat all right so I just went from a low rpm to idle I got the alarm so I'm gonna go page engine to show the engine data here I'll stabilize myself that's the engine data 640 rpm and that's the light that we get with the beep and here's our, our steam gauges, low RPM, Ch oil pressure looks good, temperature looks good, trim's fine, bolts are fine, and it's all in agreement here, you know, reasonable oil uh, for an idle, 
volts, coolant, good, 150. I don't know what's going on, why do I... Two lights, three beeps. Gauges look fine. Red light staying on. So we just started it. Red light is on. We're neutral. So we'll do a little experiment here. We're going to go engine data and uh, we're going to shift it out of take the shifter and defeat the drive and just to get the RPMs up. Okay, so we just restarted the motor and the red light, uh, red triangle light remains on. Uh, everything else looks like it's fine. Again, the temperatures seem fine when I check the uh, uh, exhaust riser manifolds and the uh, freshwater side's hot to the touch, obviously, about 150F. Yeah. The raw water side was warm to the touch, but easily to touch, doesn't feel hot. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna try something here. We're at 660 RPM here, and the red light's on. We're gonna slowly bring the RPM up. We've got the engine out of gear. And here we go. Anybody doing any good on the sound on the east side of the hole? 700. Okay, it went out. The light went out at about 750 RPM. I don't know why. So just on that. How deep was it? Okay, back into back into neutral 640 boom the light came back okay we'll try that again here we go so we're out of gear <coughs> lights on one beep 650 Pro line, Dave. See that. this this reads high this is can bus data here so this one says 750, this one says 650. Okay, went out at about 700 RPM. Okay, 700. So I'm gonna come back on RPM, but not go to neutral this time. No light, 700, 657, nothing. And gonna click into neutral. That's what we're hoping for. All right, I don't know what's going on here. All right, we're gonna... So neutral. Data just went away because the engine's been off a while. Gonna come back now because I just turned it on. <coughs> Both lights are on. <coughs> we heard three pumps, three beeps, I mean, and the fuel pump. Alright, we're gonna start it. Here we go. Good start. Currently no light. RPM's coming down. Temperature looks a little bit high right now, 156.2. Coming down 154.4. All right. Again, 670 RPM. We're going to click it in the gear. Okay, so we're in gear. It dropped to 622 RPM for a moment. No lights. 660. Accelerate a little bit here. Just a little bit. 900, 990, this one's close, about 1050, 990, no lights, I'm going to go up a little notch here, okay, we're at 1185, and this one says about 1300, no lights, everything looks good, I don't know what's going on. Wow, I think things are getting great miles per gallon, not miles per hour. Eco, engine eco, 3.4. All right, well, it's out currently. I don't know why it came back. 
able to disperse. Just for the record, we're gonna, gonna pull back to low into neutral here. Here we go. 900, 930, 900, 825, 841, 739, 700, 675. We're in click, we're neutral. RPM is 660, lights out. So there you have it. I don't know what's going on. We're running Chevron with Tecrolene 89 octane, and we're putting in just a normal uh, dose of Marine Stabil fuel stabilizer, water remover, etc. It's all in the manual to use that stuff. the uh, engine warning I'm at like 1400 rpm I just came off came off of uh, throttle I didn't go below 1400 this one says 1273 single single red triangle I'm coming in here so steam gauge is like 1400 can bus says about 1260 we got the red light single red light. What, what the heck's going on here? Jesus, then I pull back power, I get, I'm the 